Okay, a uh, little review of the projects or overview of the projects for this winter. One of them is this uh, uh, Chicago pneumatic machinery air compressor. And uh, I believe it's I believe it's uh, January 1927. And it's got a Morrison Brothers uh, riveted tank on it and uh, and brazed. They had a process of riveting and brazing tanks at that time. And I believe that they stopped making riveted tanks sometime prior to. Uh, November, uh, September, November, uh, November of uh, 1928. But anyway, we're uh, I'm uh, I'm taking it apart to uh, to do a hydro test on the on the uh, tank itself. Uh, the pop off is rated at 225 I'm going to change that to probably 140 or 150 and and somehow use it use it to uh, somehow uh, shut shut it down to 125 it's got tags on it only tag on it that's missing is the Morrison Brothers tag it's got a Century half horse motor and the only thing I know is that nothing's locked up, so and there was uh there was no water in the tank. So this is one of the projects this winter. And then uh we got this fan that we're gonna try and well we're gonna put this uh Wisconsin two cylinder on this barn fan big barn fan, pillow block barn fan. We got a Wisconsin uh, air-cooled four-cylinder with a pump on it. We're gonna get that thing running this winter. We got a Hercules uh, generator set. That's in the shop finally. We got this uh, Yoast vice, pattern vice we're working on. And of course we got that screw cabinet that um kind of stymie that I I can't uh I can't finish the I can't finish the lettering on it. It's basically what it boiled down to the the damn the damn pen is well the letters are so small I can't well, I'm having trouble holding the pen. But these letters here are 3 8 tall. And they gradually get bigger to 7 16 tall. I've done the topper, but that was a chore in itself and had to fix a lot of blots. So that's kind of on hold for now until I can find somebody that wants to letter it up. That's all right. It's not going anywhere. Okay. Thanks for watching my video.